Hello everyone and welcome to this video. So yesterday was quite an eventful day. We got new star coin codes, we said goodbye to the disco and there were also some other things but the main reason as to why I'm making this video is because I just want to do a little recap especially for the codes because the last one we got pretty late. I think I posted my video at like 10 at night which is you know I would guess a lot of people are asleep or at least not hacking like star stable youtube so yes we did hit the goal we got three star coin codes which is pretty nice so yeah we're just going to go ahead and check them out so as always i hope you enjoyed this video and if you do make sure to subscribe to my channel and now let's get into it star stable gave us a challenge and that was for 200,000 players to log on today and go to the Ford Pinta Disco. Star Stable will be updating the disco next Wednesday, which is like, what, less than a week from now? And it's gonna look completely different. I'm not even gonna go into the details because from the little sneak peeks that we've gotten, I wouldn't say I like it. I think the problem with SSO is that they kind of forget about the I don't know, the architectural integrity of the place, like they completely change it and a lot of times it doesn't even fit with the other things that are surrounding it. For example, the new writing arena, I just feel like it doesn't, or is it the writing hall? I always forget even though it's been years, but yeah, I just feel like it doesn't fit as well as the last one did, like that one just looked like it belonged there and this one just looks like Star Stable bought it off of Timu and then just placed it over there. But anyway, yeah, we needed to get 200,000 players to log on and just go to the disco. And honestly, it is pretty cool. I went to the disco earlier today and it was totally empty. It was just me and one other person, but I visited a couple of minutes ago and it was so full. It's honestly so cute. Like when I was riding towards it for the first time, not many people loaded and I thought that there was like five people, but then I saw all of the horses and it is honestly very exciting. I recommend going there. But as you know, Star Civil made this post earlier today. They said, hi Star Fam, ready for a challenge. The Ford Pinta Disco is getting a makeover next week, so let's give the old disco one last groovy party. Join us at the disco and let's see if we can get 200,000 players in there before the day ends. If we hit the goal, you'll earn some awesome rewards. We'll keep you updated on our stories with your progress and the cool prizes you've unlocked. Let's make it a night to remember, don't worry if the disco isn't open yet, your presence counts either way. Star Civil didn't explain it in the best way, like I feel like it would be better if they gave us more details, but I guess we got the gist of it. So the milestones for the rewards were 50,000 players, 100,000 players, 150,000 players, and 200,000 players. And to be honest, I really didn't think that we'd be able to reach the like, at least not the last goal because 200,000 is such a large number, but we did hit it. So for the first milestone, we hit like three hours after Star Civil put out this challenge and we got a code for 10 star coins it is called groovy pony and yeah just make sure to redeem it if i had to guess these codes will probably be available maybe until the end of tomorrow or the day after the reward for us reaching 100,000 players was 24 hours of double star coins. So if you want to get some star coins, you can go to Star Sybil's website and buy them. The reward for 150,000 players was 15 star coins and the code is called Jorvik Vibes. And just a couple of minutes ago, Star Sybil posted that we have reached the final goal and the reward for the final goal is 50 star coins. Star Sybil said you did it. 200,000 players turned up to bid farewell to the disco before its epic revival. Your final redeem code is Viva La Pinta. We're blown away by our amazing community coming together to celebrate the nostalgia of this legendary disco. Thank you, everyone. And it definitely isn't as much as I honestly expected. I thought we'd get like, you know, 10 star coins, 
15 or 20, 50, and maybe 100. But combined with all of the codes we've already gotten this month, this is honestly amazing. Like, we just got an extra, like, what, 75 star coins for basically nothing. Or I guess it's not for nothing. It's it's a fun activity. I think this was such a great idea to, to kind of commemorate the old disco before it disappears. And to kind of gather the community together, it was the community effort. Thank you so much, everyone, for joining. Honestly, I'm pretty surprised that we reached this goal because, yeah, 200,000 when I first saw it, I thought that, you know, there's no way, especially... I think we hit the first milestone pretty late, but once we started, I guess it did kind of snowball. And I hope Star Civil repeats this in the future because especially when you actually do have to do something with other players in the game, I feel like it's kind of different. And I'm sure a lot of people created some really nice memories. Overall, it's just so amazing to see the disco be so full after so many years. It was pretty surprising, but still a really nice sight to see and again just as opposed to when we have to like make a post or comment or I don't know do something else when you actually have to do something in game and you know to actually see other community members it really does make a difference and and again it was just really fun and I hope everyone enjoyed it a lot but it's still not over if you want to go to the disco make sure to do it I'm sure there's still going to be so many people over there and yeah, just make sure to have fun, maybe create a little drama if you're bored, or maybe just watch other people, you know, fight. I feel like drama is always so fun to look at from the outside. I mean, for the most part, because it's really nice. You can take breaks, you can just, you know, be invested for 10 minutes and then go about your day. Again, make sure to redeem all of the codes that we've gotten today. The first one was Groovy Pony, and this code gives you 10 star coins. Then, if you want to buy some star coins, you can also do it right now, and you're going to get double just star coins for the same amount of money. The second code that we got is called Your Big Vibes, and this code gives you 15 star coins. And the last code, which you definitely shouldn't like, not redeem is Viva La Pinta and this one will give you 50 star coins so combined 75 star coins which is so amazing and you know these kinds of like community events are so fun so cute it was just so adorable to look at all of the people though at least on my server for the most part people were like complaining which was so funny i mean i wasn't really looking at the chat much but anytime i looked at it if people were just not happy with sso which i get but at the same time you know i feel like they are treating us better now than they used to i mean at least in regards to the codes which i feel like are one of the best things also with the horses i mean i feel like i always talk about this nowadays as always i hope you enjoyed and i'm gonna see you in the next video bye Silent the old trail, wandering along, walking through a land, a land they're calling doubt. A long, long time ago, this land was colorful, filled with love and joy, where no one felt alone.